seven and a half years later, we can point to the precise moment that permanent Washington decided to send Donald Trump to prison. Here it is. It's from the Republican candidates debate in Greenville, South Carolina. We should have never been in Iraq. We have destabilized right. the Middle East. They lied. Okay. They said there were weapons of mass destruction. There were none, and they knew there were none. There were no weapons of mass right. destruction. Okay, Go. all right. Go. Go. We should never have been in Iraq, Trump said. We destabilized the Middle East. Now, by the time Trump said that, a lot of Republican primary voters were starting to reach the same conclusion. How could they not? But it was the next line that doomed Trump to today's arrest. They lied, he said. There were no weapons of mass destruction, and they knew there were none. Now, when he said that, a few in the crowd booed. Most just sat there in silence, stunned. Can he say that? Well, he said it anyway. And by saying that, he sealed his fate. That was the one thing you were not allowed to say, because it implicated too many people on both sides, which on this topic is really just one side. Hillary Clinton was guilty of it, but so was Paul Ryan. All of them were guilty. They all knew they all lied. And to a person, they hated Donald Trump for exposing them. You can say whatever you want about Donald Trump or Tucker Carlson. Tucker Carlson is right on this one, bro.